Woody's world today. I, I'm, I'm going to be totally serious today. Uh, we lost yesterday uh, a close friend, and I'd like to take a moment and salute him. And I don't. I, I know that everyone watching this show has got to be a sports fan. So that means that you've seen Stuart Scott. You have listened to him over the years. Some of you have thought he was too rah-rah. Some of you have thought he's the best there ever was. But I worked with him on a show called Dream Job for three seasons and got to know him. And I would like to give you a little insight into, into uh, Stuart Scott. He was a gentleman. And that was the most important thing. I watched him interact with people, and I actually learned from him. He treated everyone he ever met as an equal. When he met you on the street, he would ask your name, and he would ask you where you went to school and where you're from. He's, like me, he's from the South. He went to school at the University of North Carolina. And I thought the tribute that Michael Jordan gave him in the last day or so about uh, what he did and we've talked about it with ESPN people, and I've reached out that he brought to the world a new dictionary word, booyah. And as I said, so not everybody got, got that, but he would say things like, you know, his play was cooler than the other side of the pillow. He brought a lot of lexicon and a lot of rah-rah is the way I put it. He was excited, excited about what he talked about. And I think that all of us in broadcasting can take a lesson from him. He was very big in the Jimmy V Foundation, and what killed Jimmy V was what killed Stuart Scott. He got cancer for the second time, and then he battled like he had battled his entire life. I remember talking to him about he was at spring training, and a player threw a ball, and it, and it errantly knocked his eye out, and he dealt with that. And I feel for his family, especially his two daughters, 15 and 19. Stuart Scott... He helped me a great deal when I was at ESPN in New York, and we're going to miss him. We're going to miss his, his feeling, his raw rawness, his love for the games that we play. Rest in peace, Stuart Scott. You were a gentleman. You were a good man.